Hey Pisces, welcome back guys. If you are new, you are welcome. Pisces, this is the everything deck. It's like six decks in one that I need to turn into cards. Um, so Pisces, we're just going to dig in. I'm gonna separate, shuffle, 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 whatever I can, and then we'll go, right? Pisces, anything that come out may or may not resonate. Guys, don't forget, take a card, flip a card, leave a card, write a card, surf a card, like the magic carpet, right? You know it's not for you, it's not for you, but this is energy, it's Holy Spirit, so Pisces, all placements. What is in their energy space, spirit, spirit, what are they dealing with, past, present, or future? What is to come, Pisces? Spirit of Pisces, all placement, past, present, or future. Pisces, some of you guys are in the space of letting go. You're letting go, Pisces. Pisces, you're saying that somebody lied the whole time. You're letting go. You realize or you feel that somebody lied to you the whole time in a connection or something. Pisces, somebody could be trying to do spell work on you. Doesn't necessarily have to be this person. Somebody, for those of you out there that wants marriage, Whoever you're dealing with, they don't want marriage, Pisces. They just want to have fun. Spirit said you need to protect your energy, guys. This is a player energy. They repeat the same mistakes. So this person keeps doing the same thing over and over and over again, Pisces. dealing with a player who doesn't want to get married they could also be doing spell work on you pisces to keep you in their energy or to keep you coming back to them this person could be a bastard pisces maybe you see them as a bastard right pisces they can feel your energy so this person is doing spell work guys i'm getting the collective chill pisces you can't even believe that you ever check for this person like ever, ever. Like how the F did I end up here, right? Well, this person here that says forget marriage, let's just have fun. To them, Pisces, you're their happy place. <laughs> you're their happy place. You're just, you're just fun. This person here where you need to protect your energy, they like the way you treat them, but they're dirty. They said, I like the way you treat me, but I'm dirty, Pisces. So... And, and be careful because the player, they're good all by themselves. They don't need any problems. Pisces. What else, Pisces? And when I tell you everything is in this deck, everything is in the deck. In these decks, right? Pisces, spirits say you need to keep going. Whatever you're doing, you're going. Keep going. You already know. You see this person as a bastard. You see that they play, they play games. They can feel your energy too. Pisces, whoever this person is who doesn't want to get married and all that stuff and doing spell work, they just want you around. Uh, they're jealous of your lifestyle though. Someone's jealous of your lifestyle, how you living, how you doing, you know, what you're doing, where you work, what you're driving. Now for others... You changed somebody. No, you changed. And they don't like it. This could be the same person that's doing spell work on you. This person here that thinks you're their happy place, Pisces, they fell hard for you. But they don't want to marry you. 
They feel hard for you. They have fun with you. You know, it's a good time for them. In their eyes, Pisces, you're perfect. They say you're perfect to me, Pisces. And the player's losing hope. Pisces, I think you, you about faced on this person, right? Guys, we're going to go back to this deck, but we're going to pull some tarot, and then I'm going to come back out again. But for now, let's, let's talk about this one here. So, Pisces, you realize something about this person. Maybe you know that they're still a player. They haven't changed. Um, Spirit is encouraging you to keep going. This same person that wants to play with you, Pisces, is also jealous of you. They're jealous of your lifestyle, whatever you're doing. To them, you're perfect, right? They don't like that. Let me leave this over here. I don't want the blow those cards. What's going on with this person here, Pisces, that you're letting go of? You'll never marry this person. Know that. Holy Spirit. Two Pisces. Two of Wands. Pisces, the fact that you're letting go, you probably already entered into a new connection, like with no regrets, with no regrets. You, 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 you have no regrets, right? This person here was a lot. It's the Ten of Swords, but the Ten of Swords in reverse. So Pisces, they feel like you two have unfinished business. They're not done beating you over the stick with their mess, right? This person doesn't love you, but they're not done playing in your energy. They're not done doing spell work. They're not done, right? This is the King of Pentacles in reverse. This person could be divorced. It could be a divorced person. But Pisces, they don't love you. That's the Page of Cups in reverse. They don't love you at all, right? This player will never change their ways. They're just... They fell hard for you, Pisces. And they're kind of upset about it. You're perfect to them. But it's like... They're losing hope because you don't want to play with them anymore, right? Holy Spirit for Pisces. You don't want to play with them anymore. Yeah, you moved on, Pisces, and you probably did it fast. In the Knight of Wands energy. It's like you don't even give to this connection anymore. Whatever it was, Pisces, you don't put any work there. You don't try. You don't give to it. You heal. From all this messed upness in the background, You've healed your heart, Pisces. You found a way. You realize this person didn't love you. And you're hopeful. You're hopeful for your future. You're going forward for show. You realize this King of Pentacles here. It, this was just a lot of injustice, Pisces. They played you. So you ended it. Three of Cups in reverse. Look at you, Pisces. You're definitely letting go. You let this mess go. Holy Spirit for Pisces. Yeah, you let it go. Mm -hmm. Well, for Pisces, trust. Pisces, you're trusting your inner voice and in that it's going to guide you correctly. So you're following your intuition. You're doing the right thing, right thing in regards to this person. They still with the raw raw. Pisces, I'm going to give you a closure. Oh, spirit for Pisces. Oh, spirit said you're going to get two closures. Oh, no, that's a karmic mail. Oh, that must mean something. Okay. Um, don't stress over a guy who's dragging you along on his strings. He, The only reason he's able to drag you is because you're holding on to him. So let that go. Guys, and what's funny is I had picked up the closure deck, um, but a karmic mail card came out in the closure deck. And you want to know what it says? It says, I'm not ready to settle down, if ever. So it goes back to this player here that says, I'm good all by myself. They have player energy. They'll never settle down. So Pisces, this is confirmation after confirmation. You got three confirmations. You got trust, that you're going to trust your inner voice. You're not going to stress over a guy who's just dragging you along, right? And then this person here, they just reconfirm to you that they're not ready to, ready to settle down, if ever. If ever. So if they're in their 30s, 40s, and 50s and they're talking about they're not ready to settle down, if ever, if ever is huge, huge. That's like, I don't see it. All right, Pisces. Thanks for watching, guys. Please like, share, and subscribe. Peace.